Kirk with Ibex Roof here. Common question I get from homeowners is, can I just put another layer of roofing on top of my old roofing? Short answer, yes sir, go right ahead. Long answer, you can, but I wouldn't do it. In most situations, here's why. You can do a layover up to two layers, most areas three layers in some areas. We will do it if someone says, hey, I'm selling the house. The buyer doesn't want to pay for a new roof. I don't want to pay for a new roof. They don't really care about it. I don't care about it because I'm moving. Yeah, let's do a layover. I mean, why wouldn't you? If it's somewhere that you're going to live, it's oftentimes not a great idea for a couple reasons. Number one, if you don't tear off the old roof, you can't see any problem areas. You might be covering up rot, you might be covering up leak or some siding issues. You don't get the opportunity to tear the whole roof off, look at it, inspect the deck and be like, okay, you know, this has been here 20 years. What's working, what's not working, what can we change up? You might be covering up a problem that might turn into a way bigger problem down the road. So we have seen that before. Reason number two is if you're gonna be in the house for a while, you have to tear off both layers eventually. That adds more cost down the road and then the new roof will not last as long on top of the old roof because the shingles don't sit quite as flat. So reason number two is the roof don't last as long and you have to tear off both layers eventually. Reason number three is that it doesn't allow you to get all the proper ice and water flashing details, that type of stuff. i am be honest with you, when you're in an overlay, you have to just take a little more shortcuts and you just can't quite get that comprehensive re-roof where you're tearing it off. You know, making sure the deck's good, making any changes, getting the shingles to lay flat, and you know, get nice and water everywhere and all that type of stuff. If you're planning on replacing your roof, you can do a layover, unless you have too many layers on there already, but I personally don't recommend it. The cost savings is usually pretty minimal compared to the amount of cost you already have to get. You know, guys out there, crews out there, materials out there, doesn't save you a ton. So, Kirk from Ibex Roof, have a great day.